Hi, I'm Michaela Ellis, and I'm a senior women's basketball player at Longwood University. I got started playing basketball just playing around the backyard with my brother and my dad. Um, and they were playing, like my brother's a little bit older than me, he's a year and a half older than me, so he was playing before me and I kind of just picked it up playing around with him. Division one basketball players usually only get like three, four days for Christmas. And um, I came home and they picked me up from the airport and they told me she had an appointment. And then later on they explained to me that she had breast cancer and like initially like I broke down obviously, but um, after she explained to me like what was going on and how serious it was, I got a better, better understanding. Feeling kinda like I was in the wrong place. Like honestly, I, I didn't wanna be here and I knew I had to be, and my mom, she kept reiterating that to me, that I had to be here and just like be strong for her and not, you know, just like get depressed about it. And so she went through two surgeries, and then she, after they didn't, they couldn't get the cancer off from those two surgeries, she, um, she, she went through chemotherapy. Initially, she wasn't gonna go through chemo, but um, after the chemo, she had two more surgeries after that, and then in July of 2016, she was in remission. She actually, she didn't miss a day of work like the entire time she was going through chemo, and like, um, I know it was difficult for her because one of her favorite things to do is come see me play basketball, and a lot of that time she wasn't able to because she was going through chemo. Basketball just helped me keep my mind off of a lot of things, like, um, sometimes when you're just on the court, you just zone out. I mean, obviously there are thoughts here and there, especially when we play like the breast cancer game, you know, that's going through my mind the whole time. But um, just knowing that she's in good hands and that I'm just like having faith in God that everything will work itself out. I mean, it was just an amazing feeling. Just, just seeing her back in the stands, is just it was just great. I, I mean, I couldn't explain it. Sometimes people don't, they don't really think about the real meaning behind it. They just, you know, see the pretty pink jerseys and they like to play in those. But like there are real, there are real people out here that are fighting for their lives and people that sometimes don't make it. Some people survive through this disease, but it's just, it's important, I feel like, to really focus on the message of fighting. It just shows like her strength and her fight throughout the whole journey. Like she really wasn't very vocal about it. She didn't really share it with many people and that's just kind of how she is. She's really strong and fights through things. Like even when, it, even if people don't know what she's going through, she's gonna keep pushing every day, just like it's a normal day. So I don't know, it's just like, I guess it just represented fight for me. Just stay strong and just like keep going about your life, keep pushing and just know that like better days are coming and just live every day like it's your last because you don't know when it, it could possibly be.